Yo, what's going on, you nerds? Cream Slice, Cream slice. back on the hunt for today, and I've got a build where you can just spam your supers, spam your abilities. You know, we love that shit. We're hunters, we love spamming stuff. Got some great changes to Top Tree, Arc Strider, and we're gonna take full, full advantage of that. So I'm gonna break down some mods and some weapons to help complement this build and show you just how destructive this tree is now in PvE. So let's get into it. First thing you are gonna need out of your vault is the Raiden Flux. Hunters, where you at? Raiden Flux is finally back and you know it. I consider this exotic to be S tier right now, especially with the new PvE changes to Top Tree Arc Strider. So let's take a look at the perk. Snaps, junctions, quick attacks with an arc staff increase its damage output and its duration so the slim of it the more kills you get the longer your super lasts and the more damage you do let's wipe these motherfuckers out now that we've got the super tied down let's add some mods to this aggressive playing style i'm about to show you because this tree is just absolutely made for landing haymakers and getting full health regen Combination blow is absolutely top tier right now and it's going to allow us to play as aggressive as we want deleting enemies with a single blow to the face you can stack this up to three times when this is at times three it's instant good night and if you wanted to add more fire to the furnace throw on a shotgun with trench barrel or one two punch for extra dps some good options here to add fire to this build is a fractal fist new stasis shotgun from this season you can farm this by heading to the helm cashing in your humble end grounds and trying to land trench barrel this is a great perk especially with the aggressive playstyle we're going to be doing after a successful melee hits this weapon gains increased damage yeah it did get nerfed a few seasons ago this is still a top tier pick found verdict is another top tier pick you've seen me use this in another one of my older builds but this also rolls with one two punch so get a fire team together and head over to the vault of glass catch yourself one of these shotguns and another classic shotgun that can roll with one two punch is zeno classed you can pretty much get this from a world drop from any of the strike playlists like i said before we're going to be slotting some sexy elemental mods to complement this build just to allow us to pretty much delete any motherfucker who stands in front of us the first pick in this aggressive build should be the melee well maker our melee combatant final blow spawns elemental wells matching your subclass so every time you land a haymaker to one of those motherfuckers mouth it will spawn an elemental well for you to pick up You're gonna be pairing combination blow with a gambler's dodge you pretty much have an infinity loop of powerful fists as well of irons when you pick up an arc elemental well it will cause your next melee to do increased damage which is a 30 percent damage increase ladies and gentlemen now that we have pretty much established this build as a smash and grab build it only makes sense to add some more fire to this motherfucker font of my the elemental well mod basically when you pick up an elemental well it is going to give you a 25 percent damage increase to your arc weapons this is going to come in handy when you are just coming out of your super or when you are constantly picking up those elemental well mods and you get tired of sucker punching motherfuckers in the face or trigger finger is itching i'm going to show you a few weapons that will complement this build even further so to take full advantage of that 25 percent damage increase with our art weapons it only makes sense to throw trinity girl in there we do know that season 15 is season of the bow master let's get it right fellas ladies it is bow master season so let's take a look at the perk quickly split electron fires an arrow that splits when released when you aim down the sights or fully draw it it decreases the spread we don't give a fuck about that all we need to know is that when you fire an arrow and you down one of those enemies your next arrow is going to be an electric or the fucking bolt this is perfect for ag clearing especially when you have that 25 percent damage increase and when you get the catalyst any 
arc ability will proc the lighting in odds using combination blow a lot so this will also proc lightning rod season 15 came with one of the most unexpected catalysts going the traveler's chosen finally got its catalyst and this is an s tier pick for this build as we know traveler's chosen is an ability spam weapon it is also a sidearm and it is also one of the best sidearms that destiny has ever seen in my opinion so if we take a look at the catalyst quickly basically it gives you full auto but not only that the reason we are using this with this build is because it also comes with the perk osmosis so you're going to be throwing a grenade this will turn travelers chosen into an arc sidearm obviously when you get a final blow with your melee as well you are going to get that 25 percent damage increase so you pretty much have unlimited powers with this build like i said before at the start of this video it is a super spam build also and i have picked four of the best mods that will help you get on your way to pretty much having your super back with an instance and that comes in the form of dynamo reduce super cooldown when using your class ability near targets from season 15's artifact it is hands-on Game bonus super energy on melee kills. You are going to be exchanging a blow in the face for some super energy. Now that sounds fucking sick. Well of potency, and that is from the seasonal artifact mount. Picking up a matching elemental well grants you super energy. And last but not least, because we are going to be picking up elemental wells constantly, it makes sense to throw on Font of Wisdom. Basically, this will boost your intellect up to 100. You do not need high intellect with this build because this will grant that for you. This is an amazing elemental well mod. This should not be left out of any super build. Hope you like this hunter build as much as I do. I think I'm going to be sticking with this for the majority of the season. So I'm Cream Slice. Thanks for watching. Peace.